Oh, hi. Today's pour is going to be a layered cup, which I don't do a lot of layered cups, but I'm going to layer a cup. We've got uh, Liquitex Thalo Cyanide Blue, Amsterdam Oxide Black, Arteza Pale Green, my new favorite color. Um, Amsterdam Titanium White and Master's Touch Viridian. Um, don't know anything about this color, my first time, but uh, I thought it might look good with uh, the blue and the green, the white. The black, I'm going to use very sparingly, just kind of give it a little dimension, I hope. Um, I'll be back after I fill my cup. Okay, we're back. I've not done a layered cup for a while. Uh, this is what it's going to look like. Can't really show you the side without tilting it over. I'm going to, uh, still going to use my turntable. Still going to pour probably slow, but I'll see what it looks like coming out. So let's just do this thing. No split cup. This is a 12 by 12. I'm pouring on a dry canvas because I don't want any base color coming up in between these colors. And I've got another 12 by 12 and a 16 by 20 ready to go. If, um, if you do pretty thick paint, even though it doesn't look like it, but. It is mound, mound on mound. If you stick your your stick in there, it will stand up straight. Cells, of course. Uh, 
But this, this might be interesting. I wish I would have put more black in the paint. I don't see down there. I can see a little bit of black in here. I think a more black would have been nice. We'll try on the next paint, but let's take this one out. Ooh, there's a lot of paint on there. Maybe I put a little too much paint. peacock action going here. Um, oh boy, this really looks pretty, pretty cool. I wish it wasn't so solid green there. I wish there was a little more lacing through it, but I don't know if I should do anything about it. Uh, but I'm going to, I'm going to spin it one more time, see if any of that green will go off. up on the wet results. straight and then decided then hey, let's jiggle it and look I got those peacock feather things they look nice um, it does look good I like it good result and there's a nice corner I love it when my corners come out good so say two out of the three corners came out two out of four corners came out good this one, I spun it one extra time. I really need to take the paint off. But this next corner, you'll see everything looks good. And then the corner gets a little green, but that's okay, right? Because look at those, those intrusions of, I don't know, feathers or something in there. A lot of dimension right there. So I'm liking it. And um, the top left corner here, yeah, not not awful, nothing too fancy, but and that is that one. 